April 21st, 2010, and tonight's song is Angel in Blue. It's by the Jay Giles Band. It's on the album Freeze Frame. Chesapeake Bay With the white patent boots And a blouse red and may A tabletop dancer She would smile on cue Those lips of an angel Angel in blue Cities of bars, she was kicking the habits of scoring in cars. She'd been drained of the spirits, all caged up in the such a sad depressing song but it is so beautiful too i that was not one of my favorites growing up because this is an album that you probably if you picked it up you picked it up for either centerfold freeze frame or possibly flame flamethrower which was kind of a, a hit in its own right but 
there are some really bizarre and awesome songs on here. Rage in the Cage and Insane Insane Again are workouts as far as the musicianship goes, where the notes are just absolutely all over the place. But what I love about a band like the Jay Giles Band is the ability to draw back when necessary. They can play like maniacs, like musical maniacs with these just weird chord progressions and breakneck paces, but they know when to slow it down when it fits the song. And Angel in Blue is a great example of that. It's, it's very simple chord-wise, where you're playing the same four chords throughout. And in fact, one of the things that kept tripping me up is I kept figuring, well, it's in a different order, isn't it? It's really not. It's E, and it goes to B, and it goes to C sharp, and it goes to A, and it just repeats that for the verses. But the powerful imagery of the, of the lyrics and the um, melody of the song are really what carries it. Because, you know, if you just play those same four chords over and over, you know, you get pretty old. But um, I, I find that with that song, I'm completely entranced with it. And with the, um, when she just said, baby, don't even bother to try, um, the line before that, when I whispered, I thought I could love her. She said, baby, just um, don't even bother to try. The, the, the powerful impact of that. And normally, it's funny because the lyric after that is talking about how her words chilled my bones. When I listen to the original of that, that sends a chill through me. Normally, hearing the intensity of the way that that's delivered is just fantastic. So, um, honestly, one of my favorite albums ever. Um, if you look on the back wall there, the bottom two right there, I, I thought that the, the back cover was so cool too, that you'll find that on the back wall, as well as this awesome artwork. And I wish I could say I knew who did the artwork on it, but it really is exceptionally cool. All right, that's definitely it for now. Um, got some other stuff to do, including our uh, first gig at the Empyrean, uh, doing karaoke DJ stuff there, so that should be fun. Um, you know, it'll be interesting to see how it goes. So for those of you watching um, this far, thank you for watching. Take care. We'll catch you next time.